Vi spelar Munchkin, Michael. Vad? Kick the door in. Ja, ah, kick the door. Level design. Troll. Ah, troll. <laughs> <laughs> That's stone. Oh. We strike as one. Another troll. Vad troll är det? Är det två då då? Ja. Ja, där det kommer det till. Varför fan du jag klättrar upp för den jävla trollen? Jag har lock i vägen va? Han är ute efter mig. Nej, mm. jag har död. Jag måste Sälja. Jag tror att vi möter en boss här. Mycket guld har ni. 28. 31. Oj! Ja, oh, vad fuck i huvudet det är han pungen som hans... Han har pungen som hans band. <laughs> ja. He has balls, shoot him in the balls! Var ska man skjuta? Dyrbåge tog ingen skada på han. Nej, jag ska jag ben på honom. Är det jag som är snö eller vad har hänt med mig? Jag är ett vit. Ser ni det? Nej. Då är det buggat. Jag är ett vit hela min kropp. Nej. Det är en stor plant. Jo, jag blir också vit. Det är snabbt. Kanske blir nedsegare eftersom det är så nära. Nej, men vi skiter i Adam. <laughs> jag tror jag ligger i backen och tittar över en stund. Arms, armarna. Vad gör gjorde om du mycket skada på honom? Nej. Han har mycket armor.
Jaha, ska vi börja från början här? Ja. Jag är ett skit. Mm. Öppna nu ögonen igen så möter jag igen. <laughs> jag står och tittar där ändå. Mm. Unghakan kommer! Ja, han kommer tillbaka oss! Varför kom inte han från början och gjorde sådär? Mm, gott med sten. It is finished! My people are avenged. And behold, here come your kin. <laughs> My lord. It would appear that you have done our work for us, <laughs> Belram. Not I, Lord Gwaihir. Your thanks belong to these three. Andriel, Farin, and Aradan. It is they who rid us of Bagrasar. The same three that saved you at Fornost. Indeed. A remarkable chance that we should meet again. Hello, if here. chance it was, your fate oh. seems strangely intertwined. But be that as it may, we are doubly grateful to you. First for saving the life of Balaram, and now for slaying the giant. Are there more stone giants to deal with? There are other giants, certainly. But none that we would consider an enemy. Bargrizar was ever inclined to mischief, and was shunned by his own folk. Yet I never thought him capable of murder. He must have been persuaded to undertake these actions. We have discovered signs that Agendau has been here in the Ettenmoors, that same servant of the Dark Lord that we encountered at Fornost. Then we need look no further for the source of Bagrazar's corruption. But how is it you chose to search these remote moors for Agendau? We're hunting for him everywhere. This seemed as good a place as any to start. Searching the whole of the north on foot is a daunting task. Even from aloft, we have discovered no sign of him here. We will keep searching. Domnar, Marcus. Then I guess we should move on to search somewhere else. Mere wandering will be of little value. You might search for years and still not find him. Then we should return to Elrond at Rivendell. He will be anxious for news, and we have already been long away. I will arrange for a messenger. My lord, I owe my life to these three. And I too believe Agandaur to be a grave threat to the free peoples of the North. Eagles no less so than any other. If you would grant me leave, I wish to accompany them and aid them in their quest. You Our ask a great in... deal, Belaram. I may have uh -huh. need for all my followers soon. Yet I perceive a great destiny awaits these three, and it seems you are now part of it. Very well. I will grant you permission to join with them for as long as you see fit. Unless Belaram plans to carry his friends like sheep in his talons, he will need help. If it pleases you, my lord, I will gladly accompany them as well. I too have a stake in this quest. Let me be the third. So be it. <laughs> Three who cleave the air to match three who walk the earth. May fortune favor you all. Arminel, Baron Thor, you shall be at Belaram's command. Obey his word until such time as you return to us. Now I must depart. Many forces are at work across Middle Earth, and many events take shape. I must consider what part the Eagles will play in them. You will be Gandalf's bitch! Uh -huh. okay, sorry. Farewell, Gwaihir. Rivendell. We're marching on to Rivendell, to Rivendell, to Rivendell. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> you have got that animation. You should have put a bite on him with your tongue. You return at last. We grew concerned for you. I fear you have missed your chance to say farewell to the members of the Fellowship, for they have departed. Clearly you found danger in the Ettenmoors, yet you have returned safely. 
and in the company of three of the great eagles, no less. There is a story behind this, and I am eager to hear it. Before the giant, we found trolls and orcs preparing for war, just as we had feared, and they were led by a renegade stone giant. He made war on the great eagles. But with the help of the eagle Belarab, we were able to slay him. That was well done, but this is troubling. Why would a stone giant act in this manner? They have never been hostile to free folk before. We took these tokens from some of our fallen foes. Some of them bear the Black Raven emblem of Agandar. Then we can be certain he is behind the giant's descent into evil. But there are also other tokens here I recognize. These are the marks of the orcs of Mount Gundabad, far to the north. I don't like the sound of that. Orcs are gathering from all across the north to serve Agandaur. I think Rivendell might well be their target. I fear you are correct. We have made plans for our defense, but truthfully, our best hope lies in eliminating the threat of Agandaur. If the orcs of Mount Gundabad are serving Agandaur, perhaps we can find him there. It may oh, well be. No way. From Mount Gundabad, the orcs have many tunnels and secret pathways connecting the hidden mines and orc holes of the Misty Mountains. The orcs can move along those routes in great numbers without being seen. If Agandaur is raising an army to fight for his master in the north, it is certain he will have traveled to Gundabad. The evidence you have uncovered confirms this to be so, yet we have no way of knowing if he is there still. Perhaps not, but we must know one way or another. We cannot sit idle waiting for him to begin the war on his terms. To walk into such an orc-infested pit as Mount Gundabad would seem like folly. But you have proven your skill and daring many times over. And, too, you have the eagles to aid you. It may be that you oh, will so find a way to take the enemy yet. by surprise. It is certain that, were you to destroy Agandaur, you would cut the heart from Sauron's plan to make what war What about the little Frodo, fella? But what about Frodo? Maybe we'd be better off doing something to help him on his quest. That die is cast. We must abide the consequences, for good or ill. There is nothing more we here can do but to look to our own defense. And we'll do that by ridding ourselves of Agandaur. We're off to Mount Gundabad. Your courage is commendable, but be certain you are well prepared. Mount Gundabad will not be forgiving of the unwary. Farewell, and may the stars shine upon your path. Well, they're well better than Solan, last than Solan.